This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. So, hello friends, I'm back again with another video. So, today we are going to see how we can protect our Instagram or Facebook accounts as everyone of us must have ever thought about hacking Facebook or Instagram accounts of your friends, family and anyone and also searched on Google about that so today we are going to look into one of the technique by which we can hunt our any social media account but remember this video is just for education purpose only and I'm not responsible for your actions so let's start the video so first of all I want to say that Facebook is one of the biggest company so you think will it be this easy to hack the Instagram accounts or I mean their accounts can we go into the accounts like if we are searching on web will it be easy but like bugs in the website is another case but those two require high skills and so much time but there is a way for that too so let's try this one so i think most of you must be knowing about fishing so this video is only for um, so that you can know how a fishing fishing page looks like it isn't that hard to detect a fishing page so those of you who don't know about that about fishing fishing is a type of social engineering attack often used to steal data in in this attack attacker sends a message designed to trick human victim like it means i'm sending a message to you and if you click in that and give me your credentials i mean if you write your credentials on that link on that form the credentials will be delivered to me so it will trick human victim into revealing sensitive info i mean that's not only for passwords and other stuff it can be used for anything so, so this needs a little bit of programming but everyone is not a programmer so let's so use an tool these tools are designed or these this is a tool name shell fish i think okay uh, yeah okay so it is shell fish by the linux choice so let's try this tool so first you have to clone the tool as i have already cloned it so let you have to clone the tool and also to, to fulfill its requirements so you can do that it will and the instructions will be in its github repository so for starting the tool we have to use bash shellfish.sh so as you can see it's started and it's asking for the options like we can use instagram facebook snapchat twitter github google spotify netflix and much more so 
whichever you likes you can use so what an hacker will do is he will say i'm a hacker and i want your instagram password so what i will do is i'll just hit one for instagram and it's starting my ngox server so let's wait for that okay it has started the ngox server and we have got our link and let's say you are my friend and what it's my computer and it's my friend's computer so what my friend will do is so like i send this link to my friend and he clicks on that so if he clicks on that he is redirected to instagram and i can see all the details so also his ip address is a user agent and so if you as a victim types your username or anything let's say i type it's my username and i type any random password and open it i'll be redirected to instagram if you have seen closely that that one wasn't instagram.com and here you can see i have the account and its password so by this hackers hack our in our social media accounts so as our victim entered the password here we will get a get the password and see and you can use that password in instagram and all that so please once again this is for educational purpose only i'm not responsible for your actions and so it is for it is to help you guys to know that these kind of stuff are done by some of the hackers to get your instagram password i mean not only instagram as you can see i have many options here and some hacker may have much more options than this so always think before clicking any link so what you can do is like if i have done this so as i have i've started again the server so to, okay so now i okay so now as a victim you got this link i have sent you this link but before entering to your site i mean to your browser you just the is virus total go to the site and okay so and paste that link here so let's see what it will tell us it's analyzing the url
virus total also can't detect that so let's open the file first of all you can see that it's not instagram.com and also let's see if we can see if we check our source we can see something fishy about that Okay, let's say just check the source code of this one and this one it's the source code of our link and this is of real Instagram so as you can see it is way much like first of all you can see it's PHP code which will what it will do is it will first tell your IP address to it will send your IP address to the hacker as you can see it is send your IP address and all the stuff so and see it will give your user agent as you can see it is given the user agent and the third work it will do is it will save this file as IP this IP address file into a IP.txt as you can say Instagram dot saved IP.txt and now it will also send the browser details as you can see Uh, I think it's not good. Yeah, it's user agent app ID virus total. Right? As you, we have searched it in virus total first. So, um, we can see how so it's really instrument. little fishy it's like 2018 Instagram and here you will see 2022 Instagram from Meta first of all you can see this type of things also you can find a little bit difference in the code like it's sending some of your details to the hacker so by this you can protect yourself so that is it for today guys i hope you all like the video it's just for the you some of the users are getting hacked by this trick so you may be aware of these things so please don't click on any of the links like this and if you have clicked you just check them out first you have to see first of all the best thing here is it's not Instagram the and after that you can see it's 2018 Instagram but it may change 
if an tool made in 2022 it will give 2022 like this one the instagram real one but you will see a little difference in the code so by this you can have an idea which one is real and which one is fake so that is it for today guys please subscribe to my channel for more videos related to hacking and tech please like and share the video and comment down below till then goodbye